Good morning, this is Tuesday the 16th of August. I'm Sophia Mavridis, a market analyst with Bell Direct. We're taking a quick look at yesterday's session before jumping into the day ahead. A local market closed 0.5% higher with real estate and consumer discretionary sectors in the lead while energy and financials were in the red. Beach Energy BPT dropped the most on the ASX 200 after reporting its results. Now, although revenue jumped, the oil and gas producer reported a lower than expected production outlook, which disappointed investors. On the other hand, mining stocks Core Lithium CXO, Champion Iron CIA and Lake Resources LKE closed with strong gains. And the most traded stocks by Bell Direct clients were BHP, Bowen Coke and Coal, that's BCB and Telstra TLS. Now, overseas, investors monitored market reactions to weak Chinese economic data. China's industrial output and retail sales data for July missed expectations, and also China's central bank cut rates unexpectedly, raising concerns over China's economic recovery. However, European markets still managed to close marginally higher, while US equities rallied as investors prepared for a big week for retail earnings. Wall Street started the session lower with declines in energy and financials, however later rebounded into positive territory as consumer staples, consumer discretionary and communication services moved higher. All three major benchmarks closed in the green. As for what to watch today, locally following US equities Aspire futures are suggesting the Australian market will rise 0.32% at the open this morning. In commodities, oil has tumbled to an almost six-month low as industrial production figures in China missed expectations as China, as we know, is a top oil importer. So this also added to the news of OPEC's expectations of a decline in oil demand and supply increases. So keep watch of energy producers today such as Santos, STO and Woodside Energy, WDS. Gold and iron ore are also trading in the red. And watch the share price movements today of companies that are reporting their earnings results. So some big names are reporting today, including Life360, BHP, EML Payments, Goodman Group, GMG, and James Hardy Industries, that's JHX. And stocks that are set to go ex-dividend today include Computer Share, CPU, Genworth Mortgage Insurance, GMA, and GQG Partners. So remember, this often sees share prices fall as investors take their profits. As for some trading ideas for your consideration, Bell Potter maintained a buy rating on Beach Energy. The company reported EBITDA and NPAP both below Bell Potter's expectation, however, have a strong, fully funded energy production growth outlook. Bell Potter have lowered their price target to $2.30 and at its current share price of $1.64, this implies 40% share price growth in a year. And Trading Central have identified a bearish signal in aluminia, that's AWC, indicating that stock price may fall from the close of $1.53 to the range of $1.32 to $1.36 over 21 days, according to the standard principles of technical analysis. And that's all for this morning. I'm Sophia Mavridis with Bell Direct. Have a great day and happy trading.